watching my sh my vlog and check out some of my other vlogs once you get done with this one so y'all <clears throat> oh excuse me i am on my way to work well, i really had nothing planned today but work at home and cleaning up Reporting while they was talking about this song, Good Money Hate Town. But this girl, she had sent a screenshot of a text. I guess this is the girl and the dude's first date, and um, the uh, that morning, I think the guy had texted her and said, "Hey, he had been having a bad day," and um. He went outside to go to work if somebody had broken into his car and he needed to reschedule his date with her. And she asked him for a convenience fee, $50, to cash up. He cashed up for the $50. And she was like, I guess since it was raining, she factored that in and asked him for $100 and he ended up cash upping her that. Like, what? You are, girl, you is not a business. <laughs> this is not, uh, he was coming to get his hair done and he canceled on you. This is a date, a first date at that. And then she said she was, uh, the girl said she was laying on her couch, talking to her BFF anyway, and was gonna cancel because it was raining. So you was already gonna cancel on him. But since he canceled on you, you asked him for a hundred dollars because it was raining, and he sent it to you, girl. Go by, and they be wondering why uh, these men don't want to date these women nowadays. I mean, the guy, I guess he really didn't care. He sent her the money, but that is so that's trifling. Plus, you know, the dude just had his car broken into, and he saw it when um and he said when he was on his way to work so you know he already got to spend money because his car was broken into now you finna now you asked him for a hundred dollars because 
he canceled on you? Girl, be fucking for real. Be fucking for real. But yeah, I just wanted to share that with y'all. But um, let me get into work. Just work on this good old Monday and I'll check in once I get off. <laughs> I am on my way home. I need to stop at the bank first before I go home. Don't you come over here, truck. Uh, so that's where I'm going first. And then I'm going to the house. So I'm trying to hurry up. It ain't going to take me no time to get to Navy Federal. I'm just trying to hurry up to get there. So. Stupid 8300 stuff at work. It was a hot mess. And, yeah, it just felt like I had a lot of stuff to do, but I really didn't get much done. But that's fine. It's okay. Tuesday, tomorrow's another day. And I also have a doctor's appointment to go to at 3 30, so I gotta leave early from work again tomorrow. And, um, Everybody's Monday so far, minus you know, it's a Monday, and I'm also cramping at that. I know that might be TMI, but I am cramping. I am ready to go home. I think I got some more mile. I'm ready to go home and lay down, but um. Yeah, I'm just on my own, so maybe I'll check back in once I get to the house. Oh, y'all, and then, so I had, um, I was watching Chelsea Janae while I was at work. Hey, girl. Hey, Chelsea. I love her. And she had went to Chili's on her latest vlog, and I won it, and she had gotten those um, Honey Chipotle crispers, and I, and I love those. Those are so good, and I forgot about them. I don't really go to Chili's like that. And uh, so I was like, ooh, that was good. So I ordered that on Uber Eats from uh, from Chili's. And I got my food. And they didn't give me no honey chipotle ones. They gave me the regular crispers. And then, dang it, I should have recorded it. And then the meat, it wasn't even edible. So I got all my money back. I let them know. That food was not edible. Like, you know how when you cook chicken and you really can't break it apart? Like, you should be able to break it apart if it's cooked good. That shit was not cooked good. It was still kind of, not hard, but rubbery. I mean, that shit was, so I didn't really eat lunch. I ate, but I didn't eat. I ate the fries. But I couldn't even enjoy it was some pieces that were good but the rest of the pieces they was bad so dang so I am I am highly upset because I had my mouth all watering for them honey chocolate crystals and them things was nasty them things was barely even edible come on now y'all know how to do a four-way stop This light over here on Beach Nut is blinking in my ear. And people don't know don't know how to treat a four-way stop. It's a four-way stop. You stop, you go, you stop, you go, you stop, you go, you go on or what? Come on, lady, go. Go, lady dang! Like, come on now, y'all. If it was a stop, you treat it like a stop sign. So, yeah, y'all. I ain't got nothing else to talk about. But that shit, I was, I am highly upset. But I got my money back. I saw Uber. I sent them a picture. 
other food. First, it wasn't what I ordered. Then, I couldn't even barely eat the other pieces. Chili should be ashamed of themselves. I should call it Chili's, and I think I will. Because Chili's, well, Uber gave me my money back, so it's cool. But Chili should be ashamed of their goddamn self. Little badass kids. Get, get across the street. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. Just gonna run across the street like that, but yeah, but yeah, that's all I want to tell y'all because I am highly, I'm highly upset. Highly now, I really want a chocolate shake and some french fries, some Whataburger french fries with spicy ketchup, and a chocolate shake. It sounds so good, so fat, but I don't care because I'm on my cycle, and that's usually what I eat or what I like to eat. Ooh, I can go to Walmart. So, oh yeah, y'all. So I forgot to show y'all the little things, but um, me and my boyfriend were watching it. Well, I was watching Shark Tank, but he came in there while I was watching it. And there was this, um, this couple on there and they made these things called pizza cupcakes. Kind of like a, not a pizza pocket, but like a, um, What's some other things called? Bagel. It's like the pizza bagels, but it tastes it's, it's but it's better. It's so good, and I found them at Walmart, and I had made them at home. They were so oh my gosh! When I tell you, Chef's Kiss, so good. And the husband is a it's a wife and husband team. The husband's from Venice, Italy, and then the wife is from New York. And them things is so good. So I might go get some more from Walmart. Why is you sitting in the middle of a road like that, sir? But yeah, I might go get some more. It was at Walmart. The margarita, they have a margarita and then they have a, a pepperoni. And they were really, really good. So, I don't know, I might go get some more of those. Cause me and my boyfriend really like those. But, yeah, y'all. I, um, uh, okay, people, y'all. Trying to go. Alright, I ain't got nothing else to talk about. I was just rambling off the phone, but I did want to tell y'all about the thing. But I'll show y'all if I have, if my boyfriend didn't eat the last of the other ones, I'll show y'all the box. But them things were so good. So good. I could easily eat me some of them. And the margarita pizza one is so good. I like the pepperoni, but it's but I really like the margarita pizza one. It was so good, so tasty, so flavorful. It tasted like butter. Like that's what they said on um, Shark Tank. Like, ooh, it tastes buttery. And then it was like, there's no butter in it. Is the cheese? The cheese when it melts, just right. Oh yeah. So this stuff was so good. I'm gonna have to get me some more. And then I seen my girl Shalita. Hey. She put uh, on her Insta stories. So, y'all, well, if y'all didn't know, I'm originally from Chicago. And I know they had some, I don't know if they have any here, but White Castle is a big Midwest, North, Northern chain, like a uh, food. And then, you know, you see White Castle, like the White Castle burgers and stuff in the stores. But, like, whenever I go back to Chicago, I get me some White Castle, and she showed at H E B they got them um, chicken rings from White Castle. You know, uh, I want some of the. Ooh, that would be good. I want some of them. I could. Ooh, that's so fat. So fat. But what about my cycle? I be wanting everything, anything and everything. But she said they came in spicy and regular. But chicken rings are the shit. When I tell you, I eat me some chicken rings. Usually when I go to White Castle, when I'm in, when I go back to Chicago, I'll get me. Um, they have the the it's a bacon one that I get, and I get me some chicken rings. <laughs> that stuff is so good, so good, so fat, but so good at the same time. So I might have to check while I'm after I leave the bank. I might have to check H E B because it's right over there. 
here and see if they have it. All right, y'all. I'm just talking at this point. Um, I will either I'll let y'all know once I get to the bank, or I will um, talk to y'all once I get out of the bank. All right. But. These are so cute. Oh, my ankle's a little itchy. But these are cute. I like these. I think I might get these. So cute. Okay, y'all. On my way home. I didn't stop at HEB. As I left out the bank, I went into Bath and Body Works. And then I came over to Marshall's. And... I found me some cute Steve Madden gym shoes that were uh, only $50 in Marshalls. Yeah. I kind of showed y'all when I was in Marshalls when I had them on. But uh, I'll show y'all when I get home. They are so cute. I'm so cute. Ooh, excuse me. They are so cute. I'm so excited for these blue shoes. And I just bought a shirt. Crop top, my air for you. Oh, I didn't show y'all. Oh, no, I'm going to turn at the next one. Yeah, you might want to slow down, sir. Um, when I was in Target the other day, I bought some stuff and I didn't show y'all. Because I had went to my mom's house, but I'm going to show y'all. a cute um, black old brand called Afro Unicorn and um, I had bought some stuff and I don't think I was vlogging yet. Ooh, shoot. I don't think I was vlogging yet but I had bought some cute dresses for my twin cousins by the same brand and I think it, it's just so cute it's got little black unicorns and I had saw it a long time ago at Target and didn't realize it was a whole brand and so I just thought it was really cute because it was like a mommy and me shirt I think they had uh, the first time I saw it in Target around Mother's Day Whew. excuse me and then after I had been looking it up and stuff I realized that it was a whole brand it was cute they got a whole bunch of stuff they got stuff I think I got their dresses because I wanted to get them these rompers when I first bought the stuff, but they didn't have them in the same size for both of them. And you know, when they twins, you gotta get two of them. You gotta get them two of the same thing. So they have the stuff also at JCPenney's and at Walmart. So I had bought the dress that I, that uh, the little dresses from Walmart. And then I had found me, they had some, um, some for like juniors, adults. And there was a shirt that I had seen one time when I was in Target. I was like, oh, this is cute. And so when I was in Target last weekend, I got it for myself. I got the extra large. for them to be a little big. I don't like them to be too small. So, um, I could wear it with that shirt because it's about the same color creamish brown as the, um, as my shoes. So, yeah. Thank you, y'all. So, I really... I wasn't supposed to buy nothing in Marshalls, but I was I was kind of looking for shoes anyway because I need to update my shoes with little Converse's. My house is big. Good lord. Um, I just need to. These Converse don't need to be worn nowhere. But I probably could wash them. I might try to bleach them and see what, it, what happens. But, Probably not. The value is 
way too um, way too dirty at this point. But yeah, y'all, I'm on my way home, so maybe I'll check back in with y'all once I get home, maybe not. But uh, I will talk to y'all either later or tomorrow. All right, bye. Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday. y'all i didn't made it to work i am just getting here i'm checking in but y'all know i made it the boss is already here and starby should be in the office oh so my skin is looking it's looking good i could work on it some but it's still it's looking good for the most part i need to go get my eyelashes on i need to book that and i need to figure out what i'm gonna do with this hair but yeah i'm at work and i will talk to y'all once um when i'm headed to the doctors i'm probably not gonna take y'all in but i'll talk to y'all once i'm headed to the doctors all right i'm back hey y'all i look crazy in this garage okay y'all Sorry. No, it's just the garage. Really crazy. Hey y'all, I am leaving the doctor's office. I didn't pick y'all up unless I was on my way because I still needed to get my directions. But I am on my way home now for the doctor's so routine checkup. And, um, I hate these parking garages. Just the real fun checkup. But, um, yeah. I didn't want nothing. I see that my sheet in order was delivered. Hopefully, it's still on my doorstep when I get home. I'm sure my boyfriend was at home. He 
picked it up and we brought it in the house because he did it with the last one. I'm just really mad that um, I already know them trouser pants not going to work. I'm really upset because they was really cute. Really, really cute. Exit. Does it matter where you exit? Oh. Exit right here. Oh. oh, Lord. I wish I had like my other doctor's office that had like easy. Job. Headed home. Don't really have nothing to talk about. I was just checking in. So we all know what was going on. And I will um, most likely check back in once I get home so I can show y'all the stuff I got from cheating. But I already know I need to send them trousers back. I am really mad about that. They don't make them for girls with a little bit of stomach. <laughs> Cause I really like them trousers. They was too long too, but I really liked them. And the colors that I got. Oh my God, what the heck are you doing? Like, get out the way. Oh my gosh, okay. <sighs> People act like they can't drive. Don't make no sense. We come down to the medical center people act like they can't drive okay y'all i um i ain't got nothing to talk about but it was a blood work when i was there so i gotta leave this on for what should i say 15 minutes so yeah oh yeah i don't even know what we gonna eat tonight i'm hungry now i don't want some fries and my milkshake but I don't need it. Okay, y'all. I will talk to y'all once I get home. I ain't got nothing to talk about. I'm just talking about food. That, that tells you that I ain't got nothing to talk about. I'll just start talking about food. All right, I'll see y'all later. Good morning, guys. It is Wednesday. Oh, I forgot my earrings. Oh, well. Not a big deal. It's the first time I didn't forget to wear earrings. I just think I look so funny without earrings. So, uh, it is Wednesday and it is hump day. And, uh, it's halfway through this work week. That is so crazy to me. Dang, son. You messed up my video. It is halfway through this work week and September is damn near over now. We are midway in September. That makes no sense to me, none whatsoever. But here you are. How's your week been going? Mine's been good. Just been working per usual. And then, uh, I was gonna do, I don't know, I still might do it, but this weekend, I'm gonna do some of my hair. Either I'm gonna get it straight, but it's still hot, and I don't know if I want to get my own hair straight. I mean, I know it'll stay, because I'm, cause I'm going to the Dominican Salon, but... Maybe I just won't go as often. I don't know. But 
I wanted to try to do the ponytail. But, um, I don't know what I'm going to do yet. But I know I need to do something with this head because it look a hot mess. Like, a hot mess. And it's all dry. I need to do better about taking care of my hair. Just, I'm not even trying no more. I'm just throwing some water on it and go. But yeah, I'm on my way to work. I should have stopped. Maybe I'll stop and get coffee from somewhere. I don't know where though. Maybe I'm goddamn. What is all this? Ridiculousness. Morning. I did not. I don't know why. I've been going to sleep so late. Like, like, why I finally go to sleep? Like, oh shit. Oh, I hate that driveway. I ain't go to sleep till like two something. to work and I'm just walking in as people like parked by my little parking spot I can I still be feeling a little not weird but I just don't like when people be looking at me when I be talking to the camera but I'm gonna have to get over it but yeah walking into work I will um y'all it feels so good this morning and here in Houston now if it could only feel like this all day instead of it being hot it feels really good but yeah yeah i'm uh, um i'll let y'all know once i get off of work talk to y'all later hey y'all finally off of work don't oh don't mind my chin i need to keep it wet don't look at it <laughs> That was fine. But yes. Yeah, uh, I am finally up for work. I just needed to get my life together at work. Uh, finally finished my schedule. This has been just real chaotic. I was on a good path at the end of the book. It got real crazy. I don't know why. But it did. Ooh, y'all. And it's still it's not humid but it feels so good to not, like it's not cool but it's not hot like it's been it feels really good so i'm excited about thoughts i can feel that it's starting to cool down especially um i could feel it last night when um as i saw with the dogs it wasn't like cool but when the wind was blowing it wasn't like it was hot air. It was like a nice breeze. So, yeah, y'all. Oh, yeah, and y'all, I got my uh, second package from she in yesterday. But what did I do yesterday? I didn't show y'all. I don't know. I forgot. But for whatever reason, I didn't show y'all. When I got my second package... I'm going to um, show you the pieces I got. At least one of the pieces I already know. And I got another package that's coming from Shein, she, she but I forgot what this said. It doesn't probably won't be here until next week. Because I found out that they have petite stuff. I just don't know if I got the right 
is them jeans that I got. Them pants is so long. Long. Like I had ordered them in a large, but they're too big. Like they're not too big, but they're like they give that baggy look. And the large just makes it look way too baggy. I already don't have no no bootie. So you know, I got sad look out, you know, just worse. So, uh, yeah, so I ordered a medium. I was hoping that they would, dang, why are the cards coming so fast? I was hoping that they would have the same type of pant in, um, in petite, but they didn't. And then I got these gut. Man, you should have had your turn signal on already. Come on, man, so I can go. Come on. Peed off, because that little red SUV, whatever it was, should have been half the damn turn signal on. But yeah. Um, but they didn't have like the ex same exact piece. They had some other ones, but I didn't really like them. They were in petite, so. I, what did I order? I ordered some pants and petite, but I forgot which one. I'd have to show you once I get them. Hopefully. I think they, it said they'll be here next week. Dang, sir, so why are you driving so slow? Ain't nobody in front of you. Um, dang, I'm going to go with 30 miles. Go with 25 miles an hour. But, um, yeah. And then my team order will be here. It's here tomorrow. So maybe I'll get a chance to show y'all what I got from there. I got, I'll show y'all. I ain't gonna tell y'all. I'll just show y'all once I get my team order. I'm actually kind of excited about what I got from team. So we will see once it comes in. Ooh, Ooh excuse me, man. When I went to Target, I forgot to show y'all what I got from Target. Uh, what was it? This week, when I went this weekend. So, I'm going to show y'all. Oh, and I need to text my uncle. Because I bought two shirts from my nieces. They're not my nieces. I always call them my nieces. They're not my nieces. They're my cousins. But they just so much younger than me. So, like. I don't know if I've ever told y'all, but I have two uncles. Dang, why are you coming so slow? I have two uncles, um, my two youngest uncles on my mom's side, I'm gonna say my dad's, my mom's side are seven years and four and a half years older than me. So more, they're more like brothers than uncles. So, uh, it was funny whenever his, um, his ex-girlfriend was pregnant and he was like, what would what they gonna be? The, he was like, I keep on wanting to call them your nieces, but they're gonna be your cousins. I was like, yeah. He was like, I be forgetting because we just so close in age that I don't know what to call them, whether your nieces or your cousins. I was like, I can be their auntie cousin. They can call me Auntie Brittany. It don't matter. Or call me Brittany. It don't matter. It's not a big deal. But it's funny because now I be catching myself talking about a niece and they're not my nieces. Oh, it must have rained over here. They not my nieces, they my cousins. My twin cousins. And it was so cute from my grandpa's. I think it was the 70th we went to Atlanta. And, um, or 75th. 70th or 75th. I don't remember which one it was, but I went, it was me and my mom, me and my mom, and then my cousin that's a year younger than me came with my aunt and then we took a picture with my grandpa which I call him Poppy um and funny story uh so like I never knew why we called my grandpa Poppy like I literally just learned the story this year I think this year so I was as they say today years old when I figured out 
That's why we called him Poppy. We call him Poppy because he had a girlfriend, a Puerto Rican girlfriend. And he took, I guess she told him or whatever. I don't know. Maybe he told her or a Puerto Rican friend. I don't know. I forgot. But. Um, she either she told him or that's like she suggested that's what, what we should call him or whatever so that's why we started calling him Poppy that's so funny I was like I never knew why we called him Poppy you know kids you tell them to call their grandparents uh, something and they don't question it they just But I knew Poppy. So, yeah. I am. I am in the mail. So, I'm not really hungry. Oh, I had bought this ice cream. Make me. I'm going to show y'all when I get home. It's a. What is it? Honey Sup of Pia? So good. So, I don't know. I don't know if it's a. Well, it can't be just a Texas thing. Well, I know Cabana might be just a southern thing. I don't know. But uh, Sopapilla is a Mexican dessert, I believe. Yeah, Taco Cabana is like Mexican food. So Sopapilla is a Mexican dessert. And I know they sell them at Taco Cabana. And I'm not sure where else they might sell them. Because that's the only place I know here in Houston that sells them. But um, they're so good. They're like a... I'm calling like a puff pastry, not a puff pastry, I don't know, some kind of doughy thing. And then it has honey and cinnamon and it's, you have to eat it when it's hot because it's so good. But they have an ice cream that's like cinnamon ice cream and it's got some papilla pieces with honey drizzle. Oh my God, the thing is so good. I ate like half the, I just bought a pint. I ate half the pint last night. But yeah, I'm gonna show y'all once I get home, and I'll show y'all my other pieces I got from Shein. And I don't think I have anything else to talk about. No, I don't. So I'll see y'all when I get home. All right, bye. Hey guys, I'm home. I got another Shein package. And four. Oh, these are their trousers again. So I remember I had got those trousers, but the other ones didn't fit. I got them in khaki. But I got them in the same green color. They don't fit. They're the same size as the other ones. These don't fit. But they're so cute. They're super long, but they're really cute. So we just have to get back, unfortunately. But I still love them. I'm going to figure out. I need to lose some of this stomach. If I didn't have my stomach, I probably would fit them and I probably wouldn't have had to get them. Cause it's large or big. I really didn't need no watch. I just. Y'all, I'm really upset cause I really like them with trousers. But I also ordered two shirts and then the earrings, the um, Bottega Dukes. And these are bigger than the ones that I got on Amazon. These are the little Shein, the Shein ones. These are the big ones. These are cute. Let me see what they look like. And my ear. Hope it don't fall. Oh. I got uh, gold and silver and they came together in the package. I bet you these are so cute. Oh yeah, I like the bigger one. Them cute, them cute. I like them, and then I got them in silver too. So I'm not gonna miss my action, but I'm gonna just try myself one. See how I like it. And then everything I got 
I'll link below so y'all can see if y'all like them. Oh, I like the silver ones too. The gold is cute. I tend to go for gold anyway, but I like the silver ones. I like the brick ones. My other ones are smaller and they're not, um, not as, they're different. They're like hollow on the back. The ones I got from Amazon, they're not like the actual bubble like ones, but these are cute. So these were, I can't remember. I have to look, maybe I'll, the receipt that they gave me or whatever little thing that they enclosed. Yeah. I don't think they have a price, but I'll link everything that I want down below. And then um, the first package, I think I got in my weekend vlog. Or the week, I don't know. I'm behind like a couple of videos. No, I don't have no. Yeah, no, it don't have no price. It's the little slip they gave me, but it don't have no price on it. But that's fine. So, these are key. I'll link them down below. And they came in a pack of two. These were pretty, they weren't expensive. I must say, they were like $3. I think they were like three something. So these are real cute. And then my shirts that I got, I'm excited about these shirts. So this first shirt is so cute. I think they had some other ones like this. But it's just a nice like blouse, either going out or what. But my favorite part is the back. What's <laughs> that back? That is cute. Okay, girl. It's cute. It's gonna fit real cute whenever I put it on. I most likely pair it with sun. You know, just dress it up or dress it down. It's real cute. So I love this top. And I also got. I'm gonna hang this up. Mm, excuse me. I never really had no not dressy but nicer tops that I can wear. You know, it's on like a date night or something. And then I got this top. This top is really cute too. It kind of has like a little mock neck, I guess you can call it. What is this? Uh, Emery Rose. Okay, she, she, she and Emery Rose. Okay. This is cute. And then it has a cute little tie back. That's really cute. So. That's my other little stuff that I got from Shein. I really like these top. Really excited about these tops. You know, they don't look too big. I don't know. It might be big. I might have to send these back too. Maybe I should try them. Hold on. I'm going to try it on for you. Okay. This is the first shirt. This Oh, I really need to lose the stomach. This is the first shirt. It would be cute if it wasn't so tight on my stomach. And it's kind of tight on my boobs. I hate this material sometimes. My bad. It's still, it's cute for my back too. I don't know if y'all can see. Do it looks like hope? It's cute. I like it, but it's just too tight. I don't have to send this back too. Bust. Try to be have dressed here tops and it don't even work. Get this stuff in my. It's really my boobs too. If I can have no stomach, it wouldn't look too bad. Oh well, this one's going back, but it's cute. I really like it. I can't see. Can y'all see the back? I guess y'all can. I like the, I like this part. And then you can still wear a regular bra because it's got this thing here, but it's just too tight on my stomach. Whatever. Okay. Well, this one, 
I guess it's going back. Okay, this one, the second one, this one's not too bad. This one fits cute. I like this. And you see the ties in the back. Got a cute little tie in the back. Y'all don't mind my hair on my eyelashes. They look horrendous. But I really like this top. And then it can be dressed up or dressed down. Yeah, because if I had got the beam, that would have been too small. But I really like the mock neck on it. It's really cute. And I think this color just really complements my skin tone. But it fits really cute. I can wear this on a day night. A cute little top with some jeans. And I don't wear heels often, but I could find some little heels. Or even when it gets a little cool, I can wear some boots. I like the sleeves on it. But yeah, y'all. This is a cute top from she and so I guess this is the only thing this and the earrings I'm keeping. This she in a little shopping spree haul thing. It was a bust. It's okay. I got two things out of it, so I'm not tripping. I really like this shit. I like the type of really cute really cute i would wear with these jeans but like if i wore some dark denim jeans cute flats or heels or something but yeah y'all yeah, this is cute i like this okay okay y'all i showed y'all what i got from shein it was a little bit of a bust but it's not not all bad i still got Two items, I got my earrings and I got that shirt. I still have one more order coming from Shein. I'm not sure when it will be here. Oh, I can't even look because it's coming out. I think, I think it says it's coming next week. But like I said, when I was on my way home, I got a teeling package. It was actually supposed to come today, but it's gonna come. Um, tomorrow so whenever it gets here tomorrow i will show you oh i forgot let me show you the shoes uh i got from marshall's the other day and then uh my shirt and the shirts i got for the girls okay this is the shirt i got from target it's afro unicorn let me see if i can set it up so you can see better it's an Afro Unicorn shirt. I love this little, um, I love this brand. It's so cute. The little unicorns, I don't know if y'all can really see them. They come in different shades of melanin and have different, you know, hair color. I just thought it was so cute whenever I saw it. I bought my, um, this is a cute little dress that has it on here. But they have them in the junior section and Target. They sell them at Target. So little crop top. Don't mind my little fat pack. It's cool, but it's cute. And then I got my little cousins. This little mer isn't this cute? The cutest little shirt with the black mermaid on it. I have to uh, text my uncle to make sure they still wear a six seven. Cause when I bought them their dresses, it was like in June. It's now September. So they might not wear a six seven anymore. But I thought this was a cute shirt with Hallie on it. Black mermaid. Okay. That is cute. So, you know, I have to buy two of them because they're twins. So I had one their size. Oh, I had two on their size. And then look at my little ch chunky Steve Maddens I found at Marshall's. These are really cute, aren't they? So cute. Marshalls for $50. I think these things were way more expensive than Steve Madden. Like maybe $90. And I got them for $50 at Marshalls. These are so cute. And I could wear them with this shirt. And like some jeans. My mom was saying some shorts. I mean, yeah. Probably some shorts because it's still hot. But they go perfectly with this shirt. But yeah, y'all, I love these little shoes. These are so cute. I have been wanting some. 
And I found them in Marshalls. $49.99 in Marshalls. I don't know if y'all can see that. So $49. It looked backwards to me, but it might not be backwards to y'all. But $49.99 in Marshalls. And at first I had to tell them in a size 8, and I was like, nah, I can't wear no 8. But they're so cute on my feet. I think I had did a little video of when I was in Marshalls. They look so cute on my feet. There you go. These are cute. So, yeah, I got some when I was in Marshalls, but I wanted to really show y'all, show you how good they match with the shirt. Wear with the shirt, some jeans, you know, cute little cash, casual outfit. I actually had to get a seven and a half of these because um, I normally wear a seven, but since my feet swell so bad, a seven and a half wasn't too big. So, yeah, y'all. These are cute. These are. New little face sneakers. I'm going to try to find, see if they have more in another Marshalls. Because I really like these chunky sneakers. These are cute. Real cute. Alright, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and close out the vlog. This weekly vlog. If you made it this far. Then I'm so happy you did. Please take the time to subscribe before you leave. And um, hit that like button, turn the notifications on so you can see my new videos, and uh, comment and subscribe. I mean, comment and share. You know, tell somebody, tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell an auntie to tell an uncle, tell your best friend that your girl Brittany is on YouTube. And she, I'll have y'all laughing sometimes. I don't know about crying. But laughing every now and again. But I try to, you know, keep it exciting. But um, I'm really grateful that y'all stayed to the end of this vlog. And I will see y'all in the next one. Thank you for watching. <laughs>